Okay, guys, so this is probably my last video for tonight. Um, unless I feel like doing another one, but I wanted to come on here. <clears throat> and I'm drinking this. Um, this is just regular tea. I ain't got nothing in it. I'm, um, it's like orange tea. I got it from a uh, food line. My husband called it food kitty. <laughs> I don't know why he called it. I guess because the line. He'd be like, let's go to food kitty. I'd be like, dude, you is silly. But uh, I wanted to talk talk about... Um, so, look. Everybody thought that um, this legal stuff going on with Tasha K and um, Cardi B was over. But I told y'all she had did um, a live premiere. And I actually went back because I was rushing through it. So I actually went back and I sat down and really listened to what she said. And she said it's not over. She said she she had she's already in the process of um doing the appeal. Now, if you guys don't know about appeal cases, like I'm not a lawyer or attorney or anything, but I do know people that's been in trouble with the law and stuff. And I know I researched it that a uh, appeal case can take up to six months. Like the appeal process is it's pretty, it can take a minute. Cause remember that story I did on Tiffany Moss when she appealed and, um, it took a, it took a long time. Sometimes it takes a long time. And I, I, I man, let me tell you something. I just think this is another way. Of her to just keep bothering this lady. Like, I don't get it. Like, why don't you... She, she talking about that she gonna put out the, um... The transcripts of, um, the court case. Because she said that she didn't lie about nothing. And that, um, sir, she was talking about machines and stuff. And I was like, machines? Like, what is this lady talking about? Is she trying to play like she's going crazy? Like, I... Girl, y'all, listen. I don't know what's going on, but I do know she has lost subscribers. I mean, it ain't like... It, it's not no. I think she's down to 995 subscribers. So, it ain't like she she um lost a whole big bunch. But um, a lot of people haven't really been on YouTube. So, a lot of people don't stay active on YouTube, so a lot of people might come back and see, you know, what's going on, and then they unsubscribe, but the numbers ain't going down fast. The numbers are going down pretty slow, but yeah, she said that it's not over, and there was a lot of lies told on her, and then she was like that she didn't tell no lies, and um, everybody was like, yeah, uh, you did, because you said that Cardi B had a disease. You claim she had this disease, and she proved that she didn't have it. So, that's a lie. And, um, man, I'm just telling y'all, I don't know what's going to go on with this. I mean, I just feel like that she want to keep carrying Cardi B through this. And, obviously, she can't pay that $4 million or she wouldn't even be doing this. Because a real person that had money like that, they would just be like, look, here's your $4 million dollars. You know, I was wrong for, but it's like she's not taking no account accountability for anything she did. It's just like she, people are actually supporting this lady that bullied somebody and lied on them. So that shows you how many people it is out here that will lie on you and bully you just to, um, just to hurt you and have you going through a whole bunch of, um, a whole bunch of stress. And, and, and negativity just because they want to see you fall you got a lot of people out there and it's sad that we had to see how many people you know it was out there but um to those people that undescribe unsubscribe to her channel yeah um i mean like come on just think about if it was you the people that's supporting tasha cat think about if if, if that was you on Cardi B's in. A lot of you would be singing a different tune and you know it. So, um, I'm sure that if she did do a pill, that Cardi is probably like, here we go. But this is the thing. I, I don't understand. I, I, I mean, 
offset. He's he's being really good and quiet about this. But I feel like that, you know, when they go with this appeals thing, I know I don't think he's gonna jump out and act all crazy and stuff, but I think he's gonna be like, um, you know, now th this is enough. Y'all done already took my wife through this once. And y'all know that she was suicidal. And now you gonna think you're going to try to take my wife through the hangar again. And I'm not. I'm just not going to say nothing. Because I think that he stayed quiet for this long. Because he was like, you know what? I know my, ba I know, um, my baby got this. I know he showed up um, to court with her one time. They said he was in there with her. And he probably, he probably had to, they, like they said, he probably had to watch the kids. You know, he had to do his own thing. He got, he, he, he still has to keep his, his family up too. He has to keep doing his shows and stuff because I'm sure they have a nanny. He has to keep doing his shows and stuff. And sometimes he probably, he probably can't be there through the process. But I know that this time he probably going to be like, you know what, this, 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 crap is getting out of hand now like who do these people actually think they are and and to me it's just like they want to get a whole bunch of uh kiki and, and and laughter and be on all these public um um platforms and stuff like if you look up look it up they're all over the place and you can sit, look at them in the picture like they looking like you know they're all that and they're like some kind of celebs and this, that, and the third, but, you know, I heard that, um, a lot of Tasha K's sponsors, they dropped her, and they said, a lot of them said, we're not working with her anymore, so she, she's losing out on her sponsorships, um, there's, there, I found out there was two different, um, channels, different, um, petition channels to take her channel down, it's called change.org, and they, I thought they just had one up, but they got two up because they want to get her page, they want to get, um, her page down. And I know a lot of people, y'all thinking that YouTube would take it down, but YouTube's not going to take, um, they're not going to take down, a um, a channel that's doing very well because they profit. You know what I'm saying? They, I mean, um, YouTube, pro even if you're, um, even if, if you put up a video and they don't even get that many views, they still put, um, ads and stuff on, on there. They're making money off of you and you pr pretty much ain't making no money. You know, they still put ads on there so that they can make money. You can just sit there and make, um, videos while they making money. Um, that's, that's in their contract though, so. Um, you can't really be mad about it because if you signed up for YouTube, they tell you on the contract that, um, you might, we, we still can advertise on your video, even if it's not monetized. They let you know that up front. So people are like, Oh, I didn't know that you didn't read the fine print baby. But, um, yeah, I, when I heard her say that, I was like, Oh my God, how much more are you going to take her through? I don't get it. I mean, it's just, she, she, I just think she want this, I just think she, she, I think she's very obsessed with Cardi B. I really do. This is what you call an obsessed fan. That's, that's a popular obsessed fan because, look, you got people that make it big all the time and they get obsessed with certain people that they like always wanted to meet and they get really obsessed with them, even though they're, they got, they're big, you know, they're popular. They have a popular platform. They will still, you know, I don't know, some, some them people creep me out, you know. It's creepy, but... Yeah, she said that um, people thought it was over, but it's not over. And I'm, I just think this is a way for her to do this. Because I, I'm not sure if they make an appeal, does Cardi still, um, does she still get her money? Or do, is this um, just a way so she can't get her money? Because I had researched it, but I didn't see it. It wasn't saying anything about, um. If you if somebody appeals against your settlement, do you still get paid? 
you know they said a lot of times when you sue people you got um research it because a lot of times when people get um settlements and stuff they don't get the money right away but i'm think i, I don't know with this whole situation but what i do know is that i feel like tasha k is obsessed and she just wants to keep this going on and on and on until it can't go on no more and until it really gets serious because it, it ain't got serious yet you know what i'm saying some people can take so much they can only take so much and i know cardi b don't she she tired she probably tired of you know what i'm saying being up in court with her out of all the people she could be in court with she's in court with uh um a blogger a, a, a youtuber you know what i'm saying and now she's talking about um oh it's not over there were a lot of lies told and then she was talking about because the machine and after that, I cut it off. I'm like, I don't understand nothing about no no machines, honey. I don't understand nothing. All we saw was you bullying this lady, saying that she had all this stuff. And then when they debunked everything you said, now you talking about that it's machines or something. Girl, I don't know. Okay? But what I do know is a person can only take but so much. So we're going to have to see how so. She said she already started the, the appeal process, so we're going to have to see, you know, what, what's going to happen. I don't know. I would have to ask, um, because I'm thinking if somebody appeals your case, uh, if she if she started the appeal case, then she won't be getting them. Then Cardi B probably won't even be getting her money because they appealed it, right? I don't know. But a lot of people are telling her to just, you know what, pay, pay it. Pay her her money and just stop all the shenanigans, which really, that's how I feel. Like, leave that lady alone. Like, that lady, really, she got a life, man. She, that lady has a life. And you just trying you just try to destroy her because she's a big celebrity. And you trying to destroy her st status, but... You know what I'm saying? It's not going to happen. It won't happen. Because God sees who's right. And God sees who's wrong. But we're going to see how this plays out, guys. But I'm about to get on up out of here. Um, like and subscribe to my channel. And share with all your friends and your loved ones. Hit that bell notification so you can know each and every time I upload a new video. And I'm sipping on this tea from Food Line. I forgot the name of it. Um, but I, all I know is that it's orange tea. When I do find out the name, um, I'll put it on the bottom of my next video. Because I think on... Now on almost all my videos, I'm going to be sipping on tea. <clears throat> Since this call wants to give me a problem all the time. Have y'all ever drink tea with nothing in it? It's actually really good. You really get to taste the tea. Goes down so smooth. So I will see you guys later. This is Tina Tea. Uh-huh, and we are talking, <laughs> you know, everything's TV, Tina T. Oh, that's a cute name, Chrissy Tina T. Okay, so my new name is Chrissy Tina T. Uh-oh, it says, oh, I got $1.76 is ready to cash out on my Just Play. Y'all see my video. Y'all seen my video. Y'all seen how much I have already made. And I'm about to ready to cash out again. Because I want all my money to go in PayPal. And it's $2. So every time I get the $2, I just put the $2 in there. $2. $2. Matter of fact, I'm going to add that up and see how much that would be. If I put $2 um, every day. I'm going to calculate that up. That might be so money. But I will see you guys later. Peace.